For this challenge, I'm setting an unsuspecting challenger a terrifying task on the award-winning 2017 hit Cuphead. Cuphead is a fiercely difficult boss-battling run-and-gun game in a setting styled on 1930s animation. An array of moves, super quick reflexes, and a lot of practice are needed to win. Cuphead is regarded as one of the hardest games of recent years, and the challenger will have only three lives to defeat the formidable frog bosses, Riddy and Cropes. However, this next challenger is not new to the Games Master arena. Having faced and defeated one of my challenges some 27 years ago, and outrageously, he's back to try and claim a second golden joystick. Oh, hi, Games Master. My name is Christian. I'm from Southwest London. I remember you, season four, episode six, completing the Donkey Kong time trial in 36 seconds. History speaks for itself. Well, that was child's play. This is another level, not the band. I'll let the joysticks do the talking. Enough of that. Good luck, Christian Din. Okay, thanks, Ghost Master. Two golden joysticks? He must think I'm made of money. Of course, I am. Please welcome Christian Den! What is that? Legacy Golden Joystick. You mean this is uh, an original golden joystick? It is. Tell me, do you love this? Uh, you don't know how much. So let me get this straight. If you win this challenge, mm -hmm. you're going to be the first person in history to have an original 1990s Games Master golden joystick and our new 21st century golden joystick. Is that right? You must be very excited. Uh, that's a bit of pressure you're putting on me, Robert, but yeah. If you win, you'll get one. But I am going to raise the stakes a wee bit. Oh, I yeah. want to go double or nothing here. So if you lose, mm -hmm. I'm going to destroy your original Games Master Golden no. Joystick. Bring Rob his hammer! <laughs> ah, here it is. Whenever I leave Scotland, I always make sure to bring my hammer with me. So just to be absolutely clear here, you win, you get a golden joystick. You lose, I destroy your old golden joystick. And let's remember here, you are playing one of the most difficult and frustrating games that I've ever tried. Feeling confident? Always. You want to say your goodbyes? I won't be saying goodbye, I'll be saying hello to two. <laughs> you think so? You're saying that to a guy with a hammer? Huh? Right, take your place. I'm just going to get ready here to batter the crap out of this joystick! Mm! And he's still smiling! Oh yeah, let's get swingy! into this boss battle from Cuphead. If you're not familiar with this game, it's all about the boss battles. That's literally the concept of the game, as well as, you know, 1930s art style and music. But we're in the first part right now, so you can see Ribby, he's on the left. He is smashing. If you look out for those pig bits, that's the parry. Special move coming in there. Cuphead literally just has to smash away, avoid the rolling. But now we're going into phase two of the fight. This is the bouncing bombs that are coming in on the left from Ribby. Meanwhile, Crotus is spinning out that fan. You have to balance moving towards the fan while also trying to take those shots and avoiding those bouncing bombs. It's impossible. Christian, you're never going to win this. He's never winning it. He is doing pretty darn well so far. No, so don't say hold that. on to your hammer, Rab. You might not have this one in the back of it. Already in phase three. This is the toy machine. He's got a parry. That fist. And then we're going to see what challenge we're going to get. It looks like he's doing well. We haven't even lost one life. He has actually got the frog. He can actually finish the battle if he can keep shooting and keep jumping. He's got this in the back. Christian, you've got this in the back, my friend. You were so, so close. Is that another parry there? That's another parry. He's drawn the frog again. That means we could be in the in-game situation here. If he can just keep jumping and keep shooting at the same time, he could be making history as the first person to win two different generations of golden joysticks. And he's done it! Very 
very sad man.